request? He's on the phone with Brian Myers. Um, so Brian, you're technically I'm in the vlog. Right now. <laughs> Yo, where'd you find this place? On Google. <laughs> I, I Googled toy uh, places. Yeah. And then I looked at the ratings and I looked at the pictures. And here we are. We forgot to do it. Ah! There we go. Oh my god. That's sick. Yeah, that's a, that's a new one. Yeah. Man, don't let me get back into wrestling toys. I'd say that Ethan Page needs to buy AEW figures. Yeah. I know. Oh, look at this little bitch. I think you should throw him down the stairs. Right. Yeah. I was gonna say, I don't know if I want to spend 40 bucks for a joke. <laughs> Oh, look at that. It's the commentator for Dark Elevation. Yo, these are sick. Look at this. Dan Housen is for sure jealous right now. It's a great boy. Oh my god. We have, so we have original Power Rangers, but I don't know what is in these boxes, but just by the tops of the boxes, I'm like super hype. All right. Okay, so they got karate action. I'm not really thinking about those. I'm thinking more about the uh, villains in the back there. I remember the karate action. Karate action, blue, karate action, pink. Oh, Sphinx. Who's this? Ah, oh, damn it. The Finster, I have these. Ah, uh, this is such a sick figure. They ne oh, he's like Lucy Goosey in there too. That's like played with put back in the box. Yeah, I mean at least they got the original box art. This is the best Power Ranger line ever. Yeah. Lightning collection, yeah. They're like knocking it out of the park. I feel like the way this store is organized. There's probably some amazing stuff in here that I'll never see. Uh, just scattered all over. There's so much cool stuff. Like tons. You could be here all day and you'll never see everything. There's no chance. Ooh. This looks like a cool falcon. That's really cool. Looks like they got a wolverine too. That's sick. I'm always tempted to get those toy biz just for the box art. Oh yeah, yeah. So you have them in box on your wall? In box on my wall, yep. And what is your rules for this? You have everything? No, so that's X-Force, so I think I have a cable like that. Um, I wanted the, so I have all these, uh, all the original Spider-Man carded like this, it's this this same design and size. And then um, pretty much the same for X-Men, but they're from, like n none of these are carded like the ones I have. I'll, if they have one, I'll, I'll pop it out and show you. But uh, from like the first three waves that came out, I would say. Right. Okay. Yeah. They're kind of like colored like this, but I know. Yeah, I know exactly. Yeah. yeah. So I'm gonna get this. Uh, I have I bought the Razor Crest uh, yeah. on Hasbro Pulse, which is like a 
three hundred fifty dollar uh, vintage collection vehicle oh, God. for Mandalorian. Yeah, yeah. But it was one of those crowdfunded things. Oh yeah. So only if five thousand people got, bought it. Right. So you're just helping everyone out by purchasing it. Yeah. So I think twenty thousand people ended up getting. It. Oh man. But so when I did that, I was like, well, I need to have all the Mandalorian vintage collection figures. So that's the, for that scale. Yes. Oh okay. So I don't have this one. It's a little pricey. A little too much. Twenty four ninety nine. But uh. Okay. Yeah. I love your honesty, by the way. Because this dude is sitting right here, he's for sure gonna watch this video. <laughs> Literally in Star Wars, yeah. the first movie, for two seconds, he's an extra in the bar. Come on. And he has a toy. Does nothing. He walks by in one scene, and he does this in one shot. He's an extra, and he has an action. I wonder. But he if has a name. They just gave him that name like later on. He doesn't have a name in the movie. Oh. They, like sometimes they gave guys names for the toy and it became they canon. Knew so so Boshek here, I wonder wherever he is, if he is happy he has a toy. Of course. What do you who's who would be pissed? What do you mean? I mean he probably didn't get any money for it. Oh uh, yeah. Hopefully he at least got a free fig, you know? <laughs> Oh, what's so, that? I have multiple versions of Mr. Freeze. My daughter's uh, middle name is Ivy. Um, so any kind of Poison Ivy stuff I have. So this movie was like a big Christmas get for me as a kid. Like, mm -hmm. you know, wrote Santa a letter. I want this yeah. on VHS, whatever, blah, blah, blah. So I'm trying to get all these, um, which I have no idea why I'm going to end up selling them. But you got to support the shop at least get something. But yeah, I don't have that girl. Hell yeah. This is sick. I was gonna get it, but there's a big hunk out of the foot. Oh, the okay. I can save it. So I think if they don't have, but kids used to bite these. Yeah. Used to. That's the total. Yeah. <laughs> I wanted to get a matcha. This is in the Major Wrestling Figure Podcast Hall of Fame. That is, uh, I used to own that as a kid. Of course, kid, but it's that's why it's an Hall of Fame. All right, we're done. Yep. Purchased toys. Forgot toy box. Saw some stuff. Like some store. stuff. It is very cool. Yeah. Uh, not not very organized at all. Is this our Uber here? That's uh, our Uber. All right, we're gonna head over there now. But um, thumbs up. Yeah. I think. Forgot yeah. Toy box, Jacksonville. Yeah, definitely check it out. There's tons of stuff, and you have to do a couple laps to see everything. But um, in the meantime, go over to Major Wrestling Figure Podcast YouTube channel. Subscribe to their stuff. Hit my subscribe. Check out. Yeah, check out uh, all the toy stuff we're doing. In my ego, he said I'm the man, better than you people, forever he my hero, never be an equal, if you don't believe me, you can ask my ego.